see it. I just have a quick question. Dennis sure. Miller was honored um, the other night as he got a director award here. Uh huh. He was talking about you. He said you were an actor who's. Um, I better read this right. Yeah, I want to hear a it too. A gifted and experienced actor whose potential exceeded his opportunities. Oh, that's a nice thing to say. He's, he he spoke very highly of you. So how has this role affected the opportunities you're being given now? Has we'll it, see. I don't know yet. I mean, it's. Uh, I don't know. I, I I guess I never think that far ahead. It would be nice if you know if. I got to work with people like Bennett Miller again. Um, I feel very lucky to be in, a, in his world as a filmmaker, but that's the hope. I mean, I think that's every actor's hope. It's just that they're, they're invited to be a part of something good every now and then. Thank you. Thanks. Hi, Steve Hi. Carell. Hi. Nothing in your past prepared us to see you in a Greek tragedy. This is basically a modern Greek tragedy. I think you're right. And you nailed it, you nailed oh, it. thanks. What part of Steve Carell could directly relate to the character. What part of C. Carell had to pull out some empathy for the character? Um, well, I, you know, and I've said this before, I never considered Dupont a villain. I, I, I think going in and when you start looking at a character, any character, whether it's a true-to-life character or not, I think you have to have a degree of empathy. You have to have a sense of understanding and know that there's a lot of gray area in human beings. And, uh, and I think that's what I thought about most. I thought about him as a child, his upbringing, how he came to be the way he was, and uh, and so I think you can have, I think you can have empathy for a person. Well, you like did, that. you pulled it up, and this is you 40 years ago. Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, yeah. That's for you. That's, I know these people well. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. <laughs>